Hi everyone. Every day, new online websites with tools based on artificial intelligence emerge. While they are user-friendly and have blasting results, but they often come with a price tag. In today's video, I show you how to use a free and offline tool to expand and enlarge your photos without sacrificing quality or breaking the bank. Let's get started and discover the power of AI photo enlargement on a budget. The tool I am going to use to expand pictures is called Fucus. Focus is an offline, open source, and free image generator. It simplifies the process by not requiring manual tweaking, allowing users to focus on prompts and images. Installation is also streamlined, taking less than three mouse clicks from download to generating the first image. A minimum of four gigabytes video GPU memory is required. After downloading and unzipping the software, open Run Bat to start the software. Let's quickly create an image in Focus. Just enter a few descriptive words and then press the Generate button. Depending on the settings and hardware specification of your computer, this may take a few seconds or minutes. Also make sure that you have enough RAM installed. The pictures look quite good with the default settings. Before I show you how to enlarge any image, let's save the result for later use. To edit images, activate the Input Image checkbox. You can easily create variations of an image in Focus. Simply drag and drop an image. I'm using this image of a dragon that I created myself. Select this setting to create a subtle variation of the input image. Press generate and leave the input window empty. Focus has created a slightly different image of the dragon. If you need more in-depth changes, try this option. If you value your privacy, you can also use Focus to enlarge an image offline without uploading your private images to a third party. But that's not all. You can also magically remove objects from your photos offline in Focus. Move the mouse pointer over the info icon to discover how you can use the tool. Simply draw over the areas that you would like to have removed from the picture. I would like to get rid of these two birds. Granted, you could perhaps choose it more beautifully but it's already a bit late. Here is where you can change the brush size. Use the mouse wheel to zoom in. Press R to reset. Again press generate to reconstruct the area from the pixels near the area boundary. I will save the photo for a direct comparison. By the way, this is a recommendation from me. Don't forget to save often. The result looks pretty good again. If you zoom in, you can see that the sun is a bit out of round. That was because the damn bird was in a bad position. I don't blame the program at all. Next, let's outpaint a picture with Focus. Select the inpaint or outpaint tab, then add a picture. At the bottom, select the outpaint directions. You can expand your image in all four directions. I select left and right. Press Generate again. In the upper part, you can see the preview. Pretty amazing. If the image needs to be even wider, repeat the simple steps. Nice. So I guess that's it. This is how you create variations of your image, remove unwanted objects and paint over them to enlarge your images in focus. Hope you had fun watching. See you in the next one.